The Louisville Muhammad Ali International Airport now has 13 million reasons to continue its expansion on the heels of what has been a record year. WDRB's Joel Skipper shows us where the money is going and what travelers can expect. Joel? No matter where you go here at the Louisville Muhammad Ali International Airport, you're going to see construction from downstairs where the baggage claim is and the ticket counters to up here on top of the escalator. You have the temporary TSA checkpoint and there's more to come. Ned Brown is no stranger to Louisville's airport. We're a construction company based all over the country, so we have to in and out of Louisville Airport probably two to three times a month. He's seen it evolve over the years, and the change is currently underway, which recently got a financial boost. The U.S. Transportation Department just awarded the Louisville Muhammad Ali International Airport with $13 million to be used in the terminal. Seven and a half million to be used for the TSA checkpoint expansion, a project that was planned three years ago. It will eventually look like this, a 30,000 square foot expansion going from seven lanes to 10. We did not have the entire funding plan put together yet. So this ATP dollars to seven and a half million dollars is, was really instrumental in helping us do this without incurring more debt um, and finding other sources. Right now, we are in the new construction area. This is right next to the current TSA line on the other side of these walls. Currently, it has 125 people that can line up in the queue. When this is done by about spring break, more than 370 people will be able to go through TSA. We work with our gift shop to say, hey, we need to take some of the space back. This construction going on right now is uh, emptying all that space out, so we'll triple the size of the queue. Near the queue will be this new Churchill Downs store. <laughs> But some of the allotted funding will be behind the scenes. Five and a half million will go toward a microgrid for backup power. Generators that will keep the airport and parking garage going for up to 72 hours in case of an electrical outage. With 2023 being a record setting year for the airport, 2024 is on track to be as big if not bigger, especially with major festivals, the PGA Championship and Derby 150. This first quarter is uh we're far ahead of last year's quarter as far as capacity, so I'm not surprised at all. We got to keep that uh, enticing atmosphere, getting people in and out, and by just adding these funds, by adding the expansion, that's what's going to happen. We're going to get people to come to Louisville and hopefully stay here. And the, tempor the temporary TSA checkpoint behind me, that's going to open in about uh, five or six weeks. That 30,000 square foot expansion, construction on that is expected to begin sometime this fall and will wrap up about 18 months later. Guys? Yeah, it's kind of like a highway with not enough lanes. Right. you got to have the lanes when you got the people like they do out there. Glad to see that's happening. Thanks, Joel.